Hello, Cyanogen Mod users. I want to show you a little bit of uh, Cyanogen Mod 9 Alpha 0 0.5 running on the HP touchpad. Uh, there was a recent update which has fixed a few problems, made it crash a little less. Uh, it looks pretty good, it runs pretty good. It's a little unstable, so hopefully, a lot of that's going to be cleared up. Anyways, in this release, uh, it's well known that hardware acceleration does not work for the video playback. So let's show you how to get around that. Here we have the MX video player. Uh, it'll run in a software mode, which is what we must do. Everything will run just fine as long question. as you switch into the software. Hey, my bumhole will ask the questions. It hey, will. Why do I not? Now, up here in the upper right corner, you see it's SW. Uh, we can click this. It was on hardware for me originally, and this is what you can expect in hey, hardware why do mode. I not use TV for my TV? <laughs> the beloved always did like riddles. You it's a slideshow. Anyways, it just continues like that. So this is how you switch it: software decoder, and you can play all your video Bumhole. playback. Hey, for I am the great Cornholio. I need TV. Um, next, uh, the other problem was with YouTube playback. So as long as you play everything uh, in non-HD videos, it plays fine. Show you a little bit of that. Uh, so in the left-hand corner here, you'll see it says HD. If you simply unselect HD, anything will play. Uh, if you leave HD, nothing will work. This is Lisa from Mobile Tech Review, and this is... HD. Nothing works. HD. Off. And this is the Next up, uh, the uh, USB support uh, does not work right off the bat. Uh, you'll plug in the USB, you'll find it's not working. Uh, two ways to get around this. One program, an app called Wi-Fi File Explorer, uh, lets you transfer files wirelessly over the network from your PC. It's a little navigation menu. You simply type in 192.168.0199.8000 into the browser and you're in. You're running a little server. Great little program. Uh, secondly, if we want to just turn it back on, go into settings, storage. Uh, in the upper right hand corner, see the additional menu. USB computer connection, and you'll have to select it. It was off. Anyways, uh, moving on, it has pretty much the same issues uh, with sound that we had previously, CMM7. Uh, the audio playback seems to be working pretty well. Uh, with this 0.5 patch, uh, I have been having less crashing. Uh, there was a problem with basically constant crashing for the Winamp player for me. Eh, it was a bit of a problem. Uh, that seems to be improved. Also, uh, video game support uh, is apparently some improved. So let's test a little bit of that out. I'm going to test out some new games in the future. Let's see how some old ones run. Oh, Grand Theft Auto did not want to run. Let's try Air Attack HD. Went a little fuzzy there for a moment. Supposed to be running normally. Now, it may be that I may just need to update, because uh, now that we have this update, we have actual touchpad support for our touchpads running the CM9, which is really a great thing that I've been looking for at least for some time. Science and mod teams have been doing a great job, and they've been getting updates just like this. Other people are going to come in and start modifying the software, but... Simon Jin team did a great job so far. Let's try a little emulator game, see if they work. Metal Slug 3. Hmm. 
Oh, there we go. The emulator games are working. Looking pretty good so far. I like to keep my task manager uh, widget up there. It really helps to improve things. Things get a little sketchy. Uh, although all in all, things are good. I like to use CPU Master Pro, uh, regulate my CPU frequency. As profiles, very useful. You can set minimum and maximum frequencies for different modes. For instance, battery charging, overheating. Very good program. Also use a uh, RAM Manager program, RAM Manager Pro, very useful. Anyways, uh, this has been a little example. Cytogen Mod 9, 0 0.5 Alpha. We have the beautiful support of ice cream sandwich now. An actual platform designed for a touchpad device. Smoother, better than ever. There you have it.